So that's the progress so far on the SQ amp setup on the back. I made a Perspex cover for the tweeter amp. This is a Varex 4300.2 and I didn't realise it actually had lights inside. It's kind of interesting. Who knows why? And that's the mid range amp. It's a 4300 also, but it's one of the Mark I or originals. And special chrome finish. It's a bit, bit crackly. A bit second hand, but still sounds awesome. And this is the VRX 6 Direct, which is a very special edition of the VRX 6 420, but without any crossover circuitry. It's pretty cool. And this is the RME 5 Face UC. <coughs> this is like front input panel. And I'm also using the <coughs> Headphone socket as the extra two channels to get the bass amps going. The bass amps are LRX 2500s, two channel bridge to one. About, let's say, four to six hundred watts per sub, two subs in the boot, and firing into the cabin. This is the computer, which maybe I could do a Perspex case for one day. So it's a bit more interesting. I'm just sitting there being unnoticed. And there's no beauty panels yet. Also having battery management, second battery. A lot of wires to cover up at this stage. These stickers and this glass I had just from a previous install, just to keep everything safe. And I had these stickers to cover up some nasty scratches on this old piece of glass. Anyway, so that's that.